Thank you, Dee. Thanks for having me. Could you tell us a little bit about Global Oneness Day, Steve? You bet. Global Oneness Day was created by our Humanities Team Global Council in, in July 2010. And it was created because, surprisingly, there's a very small percentage of the Earth that is aware that we're all connected, that we're all part of one presence. They, there was a study that was done that says that 100 million people of the 6.9 billion people in the Earth's population, uh, which is less than 2%, presently have an awareness that there's a connection between all of life, between humanity, between with spirit, uh, and with all of life around us. And so our Humanities Team Global Council created Global Oneness Day so that we could raise awareness in much the same way that Earth Day was created back in 1970 to, to raise awareness that, uh, you know, there's this beautiful Earth that we live on. And our invitation uh, in that case was to nurture the Earth in our case with Global Oneness Day, the invitation is to, is to nurture all of humanity and all of life because uh, spirit is uh, resident in, in all of humanity and all of life. The interesting thing is, is, that, um, is that we need to get this message out at all because it's this ancient truth, this timeless truth that's been around forever back to the Indian Vedas and, and uh, you know, indigenous uh, things that were shared before the Indian Vedas uh, by sacred texts, by scientists, by philosophers, uh, by messengers, by prophets. It's just been a message that's been shared over the millennia that everything is connected. Uh, everything is a part of one presence. So uh, this is the, uh, our invitation on Global Oneness Day to come out of our homes uh, and to just talk from the authenticity of our heart space about connection, to, to be explicit, not, not implicit, and to share, you know, uh, I'm here uh, to celebrate, I'm here at the shelter to help homeless people, I'm here to do whatever the things that we might be doing in, uh, from this place of connection, from this place of, uh, you know, truly you're my brother or my sister, that, that we are uh, one family, we're a part of one presence. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you. Um, can you tell me what you're going to be doing on Global Oneness Day? I'm going to be doing a, <laughs> a lot of uh, fun things, on uh, not only on Global Oneness Day, but preceding Global Oneness Day. Uh, let me just share, there's, uh, there's a Sunday conference call going on right now called The 40 Days to Embodying Oneness with Annika Komen. Uh, there's a program on Saturday, October 22nd, that involves healing uh, that you're actually coordinating. There's a Sunday program all over the world that's being uh, coordinated by AGNT, the Association for Global New Thought, where the church service is going to focus on Global Oneness Day. On Sunday evening, uh, October 23rd, there's a one concert that's being coordinated in Fort Collins, Colorado, with music and, and inspirational speakers and all kinds of things. And then on Sunday, October 24th, Global Oneness Day, there's a lot of stuff that's happening. I'm not gonna try and share what all those things are, but, but one of the things that we're inviting everybody all over the world to participate in is a telesummit. A telesummit is, a, it's basically a big, huge conference call that anybody can call into from anywhere in the world. It's a free telesummit. It starts at 8 a.m. Pacific time on that Monday the 24th, and it goes until 6.30 p.m. Pacific time. So it's all day long. It's free. And you'll be able to hear people like Neil Donald Walsh, our founder, Barbara Marks Hubbard, Don Miguel Ruiz, Kenny Loggins, the entertainer, Stephen Simon, the movie producer, and many, many more people. And uh, you'll just be able to, to, to listen in to science panels and faith panels and an African Ubuntu panel, a Spanish panel, all of these different panels where, where they're talking about what oneness is from the vantage point of the particular domain expertise. And we're inviting people all over the world to participate in that. You can go to the global-oneness-day.org site to register for the Telesummit. Oh, that's exciting. I am uh, looking forward to that. And um, thank you for your time today. And thank you for your leadership and friendship and all the work you do. It's a pleasure knowing you. Well, Dee, back at you. Thank you. Thank you for arranging this, uh, this interview. You bet.
Have a great day. You too.